Hey, you got Fox here. Today I got a review of Mel Renfro's 95 overall cornerback card. Now, the first stat that kicks out to us is the 95 speed. He can kick it. 92 acceleration, 94 agility, 94 man coverage, 95 zone coverage, 89 press, 94 play rack, 81 catch. He's also got 67 block shed and 80 hit power. 94 pursuit along with uh, like catching traffic and spec are 65 and 79, respectively. Jump at 95 at 6 foot tall. So he can go up there. He can find it, but he's not overly tall. He's not a blunt type. Um, nothing, nothing too crazy there, no Sherman, but uh, the speed there. Obviously, 95 speed is top of the game right now. Uh, that's going to keep up with any receiver in the game. Um, so you're not going to have to worry about uh, that being beat over the top too much in like a cover three type system. Man coverage. Here's again a guy running a slot option. There he is. Mel just got absolutely locked down by uh, the, the opponent's wide receiver. Or that may have been a tight end. But there he is making a play. So he can move on the ball with the 91 plus zone coverage. 95 actually. But uh, his, his overall block shed there is like a completely fooled out with the spin. Uh, 67 is kind of low, so maybe not the greatest for like a cover two type system. But if you were to run a man system, and not a lot of people run it, but there are some people. As I don't know, they just get so confused on that option. It was it was a pretty glitchy option. Um, it, he's probably right up there, just probably second to Deion Sanders in the game for like a a, a man type coverage. So might want to be your corner for that. Uh, but again, like a little bit of weakness against the the run gets off the block sheds very late, uh, or, or the block very late. So overall, outside of run support, this is almost like a perfect corner right now in Mutt. He can do everything you need a cornerback to do. Play a little cover two with his uh, good cloud flat, you know, break on the 91 zone. Good cover three, cover four. Just, I don't know, he's missing like, the run game is so important this year. I would say you, you face about 60% runners right now probably running 60% of the time. Uh, or, or overall in games. You know, you get some people that pass all game, and those are kind of fun games to play, more of a chess match that way. But moving on to the traits, clutch is no, high motor, yes. Uh, big hitter, yes. Strips ball, yes. Plays ball in air aggressive, which is really nice. That's really cool that he's got big hitter, yes, with 80 hit power. So we'll be able to maybe knock the ball out once in a while if you get like a perfect hit stick on somebody, and there's the 95 speed just sprinting down the sidelines. I went out of bounds because that ends the game, and I didn't want to take any more time, kicking field, any time kicking a field. I'll just take the W. Uh, so... Did I like Mel Renfro overall? Yes, I did. I did. Um, I, I can't say I loved the lack of block shed, especially with Dion sitting uh, on my defense too. So the outside runs, I was kind of vulnerable. I sent a lot of 46 also, although I'm, I'm, I'm changing playbooks there to get out a new uh, ebook for you on defense, maybe Bengals or something. But uh, overall, like he still gets beat just like every other corner on those deep out routes against like cover three corn. Uh, coverage there that that corner out maybe was thrown a little bit late but uh, he got back to cover that tight end angle there he is oh almost got the pick play ball aggressive we did not play ball correctly though man coverage c route completion dang it so even though he's great for man coverage stat wise he's still not great for man coverage madden 18 wise because madden 18 man coverage leaves a little bit to be desired i mean there's nothing wrong with having terrible i, I wouldn't say terrible not, not ideal man coverage in the game because if it, ideal if man coverage is absolutely locked down the game becomes boring and that's that's fine not to have it Mel though I do I do like the card quite a bit I, I don't know if I can recommend it with its low low block shed but I do recommend it if you like like playing man coverage or, or like good cover corners that have speed get Mel Renfro for that I'm giving him out of a 10 and 8.9 thanks for watching call to action I'll see you tomorrow